am a church member. I am a member of ICF, <laughs> expecting not to be served, but to serve. Amen? Amen. Now, the pastor will allow me, I will add, I am an ICF member who will support ICF financially. Amen? Yes. You know, come to think of it, God is, uh, before I call on Yanis and uh, others, come to think of it, God is in a business. Have you thought of that? God is in the business of saving souls, of making people's lives better through the church. Amen? Amen. Now, let us take away the, the negative connotation or the commercial connotation of the word business. Uh, as church members, we are stakeholders in God's business, meaning we invest our money, we invest our time. The church needs to support the pastors. The church needs to support the facilities. The church needs to support its, uh, its programs. And that is uh, by being a stakeholder in the church, we give God's thanks in our offerings. Uh, as an encouragement, let me read to you Apostle Paul's letter to the Corinthians. His encouragement to the Corinthians. I'm reading from 2 Corinthians chapter 9, verse 6. Apostle Paul said, Remember this. Whoever sows sparingly will also reap sparingly, and whoever sows generously will also reap generously. Each of you should give what you have decided in your heart to give, not reluctantly or under compulsion, for God loves a cheerful giver. And here's the promise, here's the encouragement. And God is able to bless you abundantly so that in all things, at all times, having all that you need, you will abound in every good work. <coughs> I am blessed by one of our leaders in this church. He, he keeps encouraging, sharing his life's story, his, his work in the city and how his how his employer takes care of him. He has been with that employer for a number of years, 30 or 27 years, I can't remember. But looking at his life, at his family, he is very generous. And the Lord, through to his promise, is blessing him abundantly. And with this, I want us to, to cling on this promise, let us be generous givers. Let us give God's tithes and our offerings lovingly, cheerfully, and if it requires sacrifice, give it. I'd like you to remind, I'd like to remind you to remember uh, the benevolent fund. Uh, I think money are coming in. We use this part to, to uh, share to our other needy brethren. Can I call on Janice?
Muchas gracias.